Our friend, the world famous Richard Takato, I'm sorry, Richard Takato is uh, here with us. And um, thank you so much for reaching out to Richard. We, he's telling us all the time about how many listeners are, are reaching out and saying, hey, show me about that refi and let's do some stuff like that. That's the way you put it, though. Show, yeah, me, about yeah, that yeah, show me about that refi. <laughs> what, what you got about that refi? <laughs> the, uh, so the, I mean, the cool thing is, is, is Ace has said, we have a lot of options and we have, re, you know, I'm doing refinances for people. You know, we have people down in Greenville, North Carolina. We have them you know, all, you know, at the beach at South Carolina. We have them in Charlotte. And the main thing is to refinance, make their finances better, make it, take the stress of every month. You know, if I save them $700 a month, $800 a month, it's a big deal for them. Yeah, it's a real big deal. $700 yeah. a month, that's fantastic. And again, yeah. we've talked about this before. Richard's a broker. That's how he gets more options than a bank. Yeah. He can do more. Just go to homewithrichard.com to get started. Homewithrichard.com, the Richard Takato Companies. Hey, it's Ace. And for a long time, we've told you about Neogenics, Charlotte's most trusted stem cell clinic, and how phenomenal a job they did helping me with my left wrist. Well, this is Neil. Neil Simler is a member of the Ace and TJ Radio family. Neil, you took the free consultation to have them check out your elbow and talk about what happened just when you went for the free consultation. Uh, they were very straightforward and let me know that they weren't going to treat any of my ailments if they weren't 100% sure that they were going to be able to effectively help my issue. And uh, never weren't once were they pushy with trying to get me to spend more money and do, you know, the, the higher end shots. Now, three months later, how do you feel? I'm 95% better, if not 100%. You know, it, it's just been one of the best decisions I've made. Do yourself a favor. Get out there as soon as possible. Set up your free consultation today at acetj.com slash neogenics. It's N-E-O-G-E-N-I-X. Neogenics, Charlotte's most trusted stem cell clinic. They say there are only two things certain in life. Sweet deals at sweet dreams and taxes. And only one of those is certain this month. Which one? The sweet deals at Sweet Dreams. What about the taxes? No sales tax the entire month of April at Sweet Dreams. Are you serious? Yeah. And don't call me Shirley. Love where you live, Lake Norman, and pay no sales tax during the month of April. Only at Sweet Dreams Furniture and Mattress. It's the Ace and TJ Show. With a little With extra. A little extra. Uncensored. Unedited. And almost uninterrupted. Get ready for the most extra podcast known to man. The Ace and TJ Show presents the Extra Funny Podcast. I was just thinking about something we discussed in the regular old morning show today. Um the new side effect that they're they're talking about with um Ozempic is um you know they already have the ozempic face yeah a certain look of that you get when you lose a lot of weight fast and and saying it's not pretty uh and then now they're um they're talking about ozempic breasts so you will get saggy boobs as a as a side effect a, a lot of people are experiencing that yeah. from ozempic uh those two things sound like uh playground insults from you know when i was a kid what? hey look at you damn ozempic face yeah. and then the other one you know what you talking about damn ozempic titties <laughs> <laughs> well your titties on ozempic look at you, look at you. Them damn Ozempic titties. Should say anything. Or that be your mama. Your, your mama, mama got yeah. Ozempic titties. Look at this. You want to try to say some shit about my mama? Your mama walk around. Damn Ozempic titties ringing like bells. Boom, boom, boom. Do kids even do that anymore? Do they make fun of everybody? I don't think they're. Like that? Uh, uh, I don't know. I don't think so. I think they do it more because uh, because now they're not allowed to fight oh, okay. at all. It's, uh, in some in some cases and then you look at other cases and teenagers are are doing things on the uh internets that would be way more violent than um than those um guerrilla warfare people yeah. that we used to see in beirut and all of them on the news ace you remember you yeah. remember beirut i remember beirut oh i know kids are just as mean because uh meredith is a teacher and i have a friend who's a after school teacher and they're just, that they just constantly have stories of how these children are mean to each other. So oh yeah, they are, but they they don't uh, fight as much. I don't think in school. 
I haven't heard about a fight breaking out <clears throat> from either one of them in a long time. Yeah, and it'll beat the shit out of a teacher. I see that on the internet yeah. all the time. <laughs> Uh, so Rob, this is your big weekend. You're going to um, Richmond yep, I'm for gonna, the Star Wars tournament. Yeah, leaving after the show here. So what? It, what's the plan for tonight? Like tonight's the, kind of the free night. You're looking to kind of you know hit a, hit a bar. No, the first the, okay. the first night like we did the last time, uh, we went to the convention because it starts today technically. Oh okay. Uh, but we're only playing tomorrow and maybe sunday as well now is this one going to be bigger because it is happening on star wars day on may 4th yeah this one is a, is what they call a 4k because there's four thousand dollars worth of prizes yeah um okay. the last one was a 1k so it was only one thousand dollars worth of prizes so yeah, oh, it's bigger okay well, well i'm glad you cleared one, that up yeah you're welcome yeah. <laughs> but on the last one you got your one ass beat every time yeah. you played yeah, that is, that is yeah. true you got so what's happening this time you got 1k one kick in the nuts yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, there yeah, were, let's uh, hope let's uh, hope you don't get four k's this time yeah. yeah there were only 60 people signed up before this time it already has at least 94 Ooh, to, for your specific game you're right right, right. because there, there's in, more than one game they play right um yeah so the, this weekend is mostly about magic the gathering yeah it's uh, a convention and this right. is just this little subsection yep. of the convention and yes. they're, they're doing a whole bunch of different card games they got a magic the gathering a, a game called flesh and blood and what's your game called? Uh, Star Wars Unlimited. And you have 60-something people in, in that one? 90-something uh, people. There in were that 60 one. in the last one, 90 okay. in this one. So 90-something mm. in this one. You'll have to win. Last time you played four rounds or five? Six rounds. Six and rounds. this time there's at least seven already. Okay, but in the, so in the six eight. rounds you played last time, you were 0 for 5. No, I was 0 for you, 4. You were, you were, yeah, you won, the only one that you won was because the person didn't show up. I won the last two, but the first, the first round that I did win was because someone didn't show up. Correct. Okay. Hey, so, a win is a win. So, was it hard to find a hotel? No, uh, we got the, we got the one that's a little further away, so we uh, didn't have to worry about parking. I mean, uh, yeah. you know, paying for um, not, not parking. Oh, you're parking valet, at the valet, airport. Valet, valet, yeah. valet, valet How far is a little uh -huh. further away? Um, like ten minutes away. Did somebody say earlier that it's close to the airport? It is the Richmond Airport. Mm -hmm. Oh. How, how big is the Richmond Airport? I don't think it's very big. I yeah, I wouldn't think. Big enough to get shot in the damn head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Google Earth it, Riggins. Uh, see well, what, what it looks like around there. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Did you check that, Rob? Uh, yeah. You Google Earthed it? Yeah. From a spaceship? Yeah, I also checked, like, crime rates and stuff. <laughs> just oh. to be safe. <laughs> crime rates at the Richmond Airport. I was just trying to check the area in general. Yeah. I got it. I'm just curious. Where I don't. You don't hear very much about Richmond. No, mm -mm. except for that, that dude who's singing yeah. about the Richmond. All of right Richmond, there. north of Richmond. Yeah, a dummy. But um, it sounds very exciting. It sounds like this is. I mean, for you, it sounds exciting. Like you, you've got to be um, all ready to go and got your adrenaline pumping, and it's a good time. Oh, I'm ready. You know, be like if a normal person were going to the beach for the weekend. You know, right? Yeah. It, it, here's the problem if you drive eight hours from where we live you want to end up at the beach not next to the airport outside of baltimore <laughs> if i'm driving eight to ten hours i better be somewhere incredible by the yeah. end of that journey mm -hmm. or at, at, at least you know if it's not somewhere incredible like a beach or something it's uh, a relative had passed yes and you, exactly <laughs> you had to get there not not next to the uh <laughs> the airport <laughs> in the <laughs> homewood suites <laughs> wow man i hope you do come back with a win though well i don't i don't, I don't have much faith in that happening i'm just going for fun mostly. Have, have you been practicing a lot yeah, yeah, we, we, the last weekend we we rented a room at a local card store just to go play for like five hours and how much does the room cost for five hours at a local card store it was thirty dollars Wow. Oh, okay. So people could use it to have like regular business meetings and stuff? I mean, I, I assume it, it got hot as hell in there. We had to open the door. <laughs> was it a so, storage unit? No, no. When Come they, on. Tell us it was just a damn storage <laughs> unit. When, when they built the, the rooms, it was just... It was Card just shops in front of a storage <laughs> building. <laughs> it's like, one of our, uh, one of our, our storage units I've been used out there. Yeah, we'll rent y'all that for 30 bucks. 30 dollars For the day. For five hours. Yeah, yeah so, so when they when they built these rooms, it was just an open spot, and they just put up walls, and there weren't, like, vents for the AC to go in yeah. there. Um, yeah, they just... They just sectioned it off and didn't think about it. put up partitions and yeah. stuff, and then the air can't get in. Uh, and... What is it? You can you take 
uh, ice chests and stuff in there with you to drink beer and, and all while you play? Or, um, or they, I, I don't know for sure. I mean, we took food in there, so I'm, I don't yeah. know. If it, maybe that's the key, Rob. You get to get like you get loose. Yeah, get take a shot. Or take something. a little something. Get a little something to loosen you up a little bit when you're going to play. Have you researched? In this time, have you spent any time? I know you practice the game, but have you done any research online, like how to become a better player or tips for playing that kind of thing? Well, that's what we that's what we do. We sit down and like we tell each other, like when we see something that happened that we could improve on, we tell each other. Okay. Hmm. So we had like four of us uh, watching each other's games, and so. So do you wear sunglasses like like those uh, goofy looking poker players? <laughs> I do not. I do not. Because I've got the perfect sunglasses for you to wear if that's what you want to do. Yeah, they probably wouldn't fit my big old head. Would hide your whole. Yeah everything that's a great like idea kind of kind of shakes up your opponent they're like oh crap yeah. this guy's super serious you know what mm -hmm. i could do is i just wear a darth vader mask yeah or that yeah. well that That'd would distract cool. them because they'd be you know wanting your autograph <sighs> yeah <laughs> damn dark laser you say a darth vader mask or my darth vader mask a i don't have one <laughs> <laughs> they didn't make one that would fit my head yeah. so yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't have one, but it wasn't for like a try. Do you have any lucky, uh, like superstitions or anything, or lucky charms you bring with you? No, I don't have anything like that. I'm not. I'm not superstitious. Okay. Yeah, Riggins. It's all skill on his part. Well, apparently it's not. <laughs> There's no skill. He's getting his ass whipped. So maybe a, a rabbit's foot might bring you. I don't know. Just throw it in. It couldn't hurt. I definitely think I could go into get it. it. <laughs> hey, do you post? Um, things from there did you do that last time like on your instagram story and no things? i was i was uh we, so there's time limits in each round and i was going to time most every round so i didn't really yeah but i mean not necessarily while you're playing the game but the the sites sort of. of the convention and things like that i bet people would be interested in seeing that i would i c i can do that it was just a whole bunch of uh overweight people sitting at tables <laughs> right and who doesn't Perfect. love watching overweight people <laughs> sit at tables <laughs> I've I mean, never wanted to see anything more. <laughs> <laughs> Butt cracks. I love yeah, that it's just uh, a bunch of overweight people sitting at tables. Hell yeah. <laughs> yes. Like, that's what we want to say. <laughs> let's say, uh, just guessing a percentage of all the um, the convention goers, Rob. Okay. How, what percentage of uh, people will be wearing cargo shorts? Oh, boy. Um, that's going to be high. I think it's probably 60 to 70. <laughs> it's, it's real high. A lot of cargo shorts. Yeah. It, is, it is by far the more predominant of the of the pants. I would think. Do people bring their cards in any kind of special box, or do they just put them in their cargo shorts? <laughs> uh, you uh, like Most of them are going to bring like a deck box, which I have a couple of those in my uh, that I keep in my book bag. Uh, oh, yeah, but, you got a deck box. Yeah. It's my deck in a box, <laughs> and then I also have the big box that contains all of my cards for this for this game uh, that I don't really bring with me to the convention. Yeah, you know what? I just picture um, everybody that comes through the doors needing a lint roller <laughs> for some reason. I just <laughs> dangerous. I can get crumbs off of them. I can see that. Lots of dandruff. And, and, you know, cat hair or whatever lots else. Of, lots know. of dandruff. There's so much dandruff. <laughs> Why is that? Oh, Why is there so much dandruff? I don't have a good answer, <laughs> but I definitely contributed. I have bad <laughs> So much dandruff. It's, it's the dandruff convention. <laughs> You're waiting for it's dandruff. It's the Ace and TJ Show with a little something extra. This is the Extra Funny Podcast. When it comes to losing weight, sometimes you don't even know where to start. You know that it needs to happen, but you need some help. Well, you start by going to acetj.com slash weight loss and ordering Calitrin. Calitrin is scientifically proven to help you lose weight, and it is not a drug. It is not a drug. Repeat that. So here's what you do. You go to acetj.com slash Calitrin. Order three months, and then you'll get three months free. Four months, four months free. That's how it works with Calitrin. Winter is here, which means you're just going to stay inside and not do anything fun and exciting, right? No, that is wrong, because this year you're going to go to acetj.com slash Gaston and see all of the incredible things that you can do right now in Gaston County. Everything is laid out for you from things to do to restaurants to bars to shopping to unique weekend activities. And we'll get you ready for the spring and the summer with a list of all their great festivals. Find all of this and much more at acetj.com slash Gaston.